Alright, so we recently saw a lot of crap, shit, stuff on AliExpress. Uh, there's a lot of good stuff you can order on AliExpress as well. Um, but we thought it would be fun to make a video about certain pike fishing lures you can get on AliExpress. Franz saw a couple of uh, them on, on AliExpress before. I think Rick mm. and Eric found a couple of them as well. They seem quite interesting. Um, swim baits, jerk baits, any type of baits actually. And what we're gonna try and do is just pick some baits out of AliExpress and just see yeah. what works. <clears throat> see how they work in, uh, in reality. So, so first we saw some swim baits, right? Yeah. Ooh. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> you see some pretty uh, crazy swim baits right at the first start. But some are just straight copies like, you know, like this artificial pike. I think it's like copies from Biva, I think. This one. I got some soft baits, we're not really into the soft baits. And the guys uh, filling in the forms with search words don't know what a swim bait is. No, because we get a lot of crank baits. And some other stuff as well. Okay. Spinners yeah. as well. Yeah. But this one over here, the Fish Girl Japan design, <laughs> uh, it looks like uh, the one from uh, Sibyl. The you know the the big crankbait um, looks a bit like a screaming devil. But the price is really cheap. Okay. The lure queen, the model bird. Bear king? <laughs> the bear king? Oh, king of the bears. The king of the bears. We're looking for swim baits, right? Not really crank baits. Maybe if you just uh, tap in uh, giant swim bait or swim bait pike. Okay. We get a lot of the same stuff. Yeah, it's a lot of the same stuff. Oh, this one uh, delivered. <laughs> oh, it's delivered. Uh, it's 12 and a half centimeters, a bit tiny. The, the T-Way, this one looks a bit okay. 16 and a half centimeters, cool trout pattern. <laughs> yeah, looks How quite okay. It? It's six dollars, okay, that's okay. Yeah, just, just, just for the record, you know, we're gonna just order some and I'm gonna test them if they're actually, you know, worth any money at all. We can, you know, catch some pike on it. Um, okay, let's take one of these. Yeah. Uh, what kind of color are we gonna pick? The trout, the perch, the... This one looks cool. This one for you. And then okay, the I'll take this one. <laughs> the white fish for me. Uh, two cards. Continue shopping, okay. Uh, yeah, the first. The first one? No, yeah. it's, Jesus, this one looks cool as well. Ah, yeah. oh, fuck it, I'm gonna take that one, yeah. Okay, <laughs> continue shopping. That's the danger about ordering stuff like this uh, on AliExpress. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you, you get a bit greedy, you know? It's so cheap yeah. that you're gonna get a lot of this stuff, so. Okay, let's go back, yeah. see if we can find more. <clears throat> uh, mm, the Banshee. Uh, but it's only 10 <laughs> centimeters, that's a bit small. Look at this, this fucking thing. This is a straight copy, the Mirror King, the Cannibal Fishing Lures. It's the Cannibal Shed from Savage Gear. No fucking way. Oh, what do we get? 10 centimeters, big, small, bit. These look pretty decent. Yeah, that's some decent crane weights right there. Crane weights. It looks a bit like an Ernie, but yeah. it has like a, uh, a dent in the... Uh, yeah, something like months, uh, old months. Oh here. yeah, like the old months stuff. <laughs> Pretty crazy color patterns. Pretty crazy color patterns, yeah. Green one? Okay, you're gonna take the green one. Okay. Whoa. I'm gonna take the. No, I'm gonna take the this one. <laughs> the disco. The disco. What's the color called? Uh, okay, add the card. Mm. Continue shopping. $5. 
five inch. It's a bit small. Twenty centimeter lifelike bike. Where do you see that one? Over here. Oh yeah. The T way. This one looks a bit like the Biva swim bait, I think. Yeah. Mike the bike. Well, it's only six, six oh, a little over six dollars. It's been ordered 105 times. What do the reviews say? Specs. Realistic. Sure. There. Color A, B, and C. Oh. Mm. Oh, there's the reviews. Is the reviews on that? Oh. Where are they? Mm. They only, they've only given stars. Uh, okay. Want to test this one out as well? Mm. Yeah, sure. Why not try one? <coughs> the fire tiger looks good. Okay, we're going to take the fire tiger. <laughs> what the hell was that? What? I'm going to take the pike. Continue shot. Okay. The T-Way, it's in Walt Disney uh, font. <laughs> no way. <laughs> Shit. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. The fish lure. Hmm. Hmm. Looks a bit. This one looks like a pike fighter. This one looks like a pike fighter from Spro, yeah. It's a bit smaller. 11, 11 centimeters instead of 14 and a half. Provoke. <laughs> pro, pro, pro vague. Pro vague. <laughs> oh. It's a, oh, it's a pro lure, lure, r, 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 double R. Oh, and then this one is a, <coughs> a skull and a penis as well. <laughs> what the fuck is this? <laughs> <laughs> We need to order this one. What the hell is this? <laughs> Can we get that one? Yeah. <laughs> it's a metal spoon. What the hell? Okay. <laughs> Do you want blue eyes or red I eyes? I want the red eyes, man. <laughs> I gotta take the red eyes. Oh, you got a penis one as well. Did you see it? Yeah, it's which a one penis. Do you? <laughs> oh, shit. Have you got another? Which, which color do you want? The black one? Yeah, sure. Yeah? Oh, look at this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Gold. <laughs> I, want a golden, I want the golden dick. I'm gonna want a golden dick. Is there any size in it as well? Yeah, there's sizes. 5, 60, 10, 15 or 20. 60 millimeter, 60 millimeter seems to be good. But how can I pick what the size? Or maybe in this one. Yeah, or when you 20 just... Grams, or 20 grams, 60 millimeters. Oh, I'll take it. I'll take the golden dick. <laughs> I already go with me. Well, well. Yep. I have two cards. You want a silver one or? <laughs> sure. <laughs> you, you get the silver. All right, cool. So at first we were looking for swim baits, yeah, and, and now we're already ordering dicks and shit. Okay. Ordering. Let's get back to the swim baits because <laughs> we need one big one, at least one big one to get get this stuff going. Uh, no. Why don't you just uh, try some, some size, swim bait, 30, 30 centimeters or... Can we just put it in like this, 30 centimeters? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see what, uh, what we'll end up with. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. That looks... Uh, Wave fishing. That's not Look cheap. Look at these. <laughs> no way. Well, then. But this is something we really like to use, yeah? It looks like a uh, replicant. Yeah. Is it 400 grams? Castiac, yeah, 400 grams. Yeah. Either these are really small heads or it's a, it's a giant bait. This isn't 30 centimeters. Do you see if you see Oh, look at the tail. It's some sort of wedge tail like tail. Yeah. But it's, it's, it comes at a price, it's 17 dollars, $17, which is quite expensive for an AliExpress look. This looks like an eel. I don't think it will have any nah, action. That, that doesn't work, I think, in here. 
it's in here as well for 14. The so same. This one's actually selling it for 28. 14, yeah. But it doesn't look like it will swing that. Hang Gia! Hang Gia. What else we got? Got some eel over here. Which was the big one you found? The, the big swim uh, bed thing? It was a 40, 40 centimeter. 40, okay. Looks like a giant tuna or something. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> it costs 60 bucks, Jesus. Oh, wow. Yeah. Look at this thing. 40 centimeters. And yeah, look, there's a kid holding it. Should give it a go for bike fishing. No fucking way. Look at the trebles underneath it. People are complaining about that we are using free trebles under a 40 and 8 centimeter pike. But look at the small <laughs> yeah, the one on the, the belly. Small trebles. The one <laughs> on the belly is just, you know, completely engulfed by the bait. Okay. Mm. Let's ship to the Netherlands. Yeah, free shipping. Well, that looks really nice. Looks really nice. Okay, let's just try one tuna bait. I'm gonna get one of these. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Look at these photos. Catches. Is this a 40 centimeter bait on a peacock bass? This is a completely different bait. <laughs> we are factory. <laughs> <laughs> we are human. We are factory. <laughs> we oh, are no look. robots. Well, we can see. How oh, they're made. Is that a cool. child? <laughs> it's child labor, man. <laughs> no, no. Oh, you can joke about that. Sorry, I'll take that back. I'll just cut it out. Okay, so we got this one. I like this color. Okay. Get the tuna. Oh, they got a video of this one. A fish lure. A fish lure. Oh. Hey. <laughs> this is nice. It's <laughs> a good video. <laughs> In the bathroom. Suitable for winter ice fishing. <laughs> <laughs> no way. Category 3D seawater fishing bait. It's a target fish for bass, catfish, perch, and snakehead. Oh, you're fishing for pike, right? Yeah. yeah, oh, yeah. No, we can't use this. No. no, 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 no. Big falls bait. <laughs> <laughs> this is bit, it's fake, guys. Don't buy it. Uh, Position, the river, reservoir, pond, ocean, boat fishing, ocean again. Pool. Suitable for winter Slowly ice fishing, dive. fishing lure, wobblers for trolling. Oh man. Okay, but I wanna see some, what's the feedback? One vote. Mm. It's a four star, okay, that's decent. Um, are there any specs included in my, oh here. Yeah. One kilogram. Hey, now it's a pike fishing lure again. Okay. Two strong and sharp travel hooks. High resolution body detail. Long surface life. <laughs> <laughs> Long surface life. Okay. The, only the length of package size. It's 15 centimeter by 10. Oh fuck it, we'll just get one. We have to get one. Get this one. This is the best, 40 centimeter tuna. I don't think the pike ever saw a tuna in the Netherlands, so. so. Oh, no, 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 no signing. Add to cards. All right, so what do we got? We got the tuna. 
We've got the D. We've got the D. We've got the Skull Dicks. Skull Dicks. We've got two pike imitations, two crankbaits, and two swim baits. Should be good enough, right? That all for 80 bucks. Dollars. And yours is like 60, 65, I think. Yeah, 65. Oh. So let's give it a go. So this is part one. Next part is going to that we're going to test it, and you know, hopefully we can get some uh, Waterwolf camera footage of the pike hitting the tuna or the dick, whatever you guys prefer. <laughs> <laughs> we'll just give it a go and see how uh, how this AliExpress crap is actually performing. But yeah, could maybe be fun, right? Yeah. Maybe this big tuna turns out to be a really really efficient lure. Yeah, then we shouldn't post this video. We should no. keep it to ourselves. I think. Yeah, yeah. we okay. should. <laughs> All right, guys. Thanks. Stay tuned, and uh, more to come next. So, that took uh, less longer than expected. This morning I got two packages. This one, which is I think the big tuna, judging by the way. And these two, I think we ordered uh, like one and a half weeks ago and AliExpress, they stated that it would take like maybe 24, 25 days to actually arrive. And now it's already here, so let's open it up. So first and foremost, this is the one that I've been looking for the most. It sounds like it makes a ton of noise. These are, uh, they, don't, they don't look that well, but three O hooks, as stated on the, web, uh, on the page. But I'm not really confident about these three O hooks. Fins is damaged due to the packaging process, but I think it will straighten down. And otherwise, I'll just either pull it a bit or boil it a little bit. It might straighten out once it's out of the package for a bit longer. Look at this, it's, f it's fucking heavy. It makes a ton of noise. Um, build quality seems really okay. I think we have a winner over here. I think this, from all the stuff that we've ordered, I think this is the most promising of them all. But I will be replacing these for something, well, that looks a bit more durable than these because these look like they would snap off immediately. Might even want to consider building like a line through system. I have to look towards my buddy Franz because he's way better at creating line through and lure modifications than I am. The travel is already bent, so don't expect to get quality quality travels, guys. But the lure itself seems to be built really good and it makes a ton of noise. It's not really because there's a rat, oh, there is a rattle inside. There are. The fins on the side are flappy and they look quite durable as if they won't come off that easily. Eyes attached properly, can't stretch them out. Back fin might be an issue with setting the hook, but overall, I'll test this one this week for sure. The Wicked Tuna. Small pike. Doesn't have any inscription on it anyway. Just uh, blank packaging, shitty trebles, really shitty trebles on them. Makes a ton of noise as well, feels decently heavy. I think for trolling and casting these can be decent. Now we got one more package which hasn't arrived, but it will come up in the coming days I think. Last one of the chop. I ordered the trout 
Again, blank packaging. Oh, and again, it makes a ton of noise. This one is least interesting to me, I think. I think I'm gonna focus on the tuna, and I'm gonna focus on the pike, and ask Franz to build some kind of modification system for the tuna, because the tuna is, look at this. I'm a big bait guy, but this thing is gigantic, really gigantic. In part two. <laughs> we got one on the tuna. We don't wait in line. We don't got the time.